I didn't see you there. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Yo, guys, welcome back to my channel. You don't know it's the Jit Star Ready J Edwards here, back with another video. As you lost can see by the title, man's reacting to my very first episode on Back Chat, season five, episode one. Yeah, this one's about cancel culture still. So as you know already, man's got my little things here, my little snacks here. Man's ready to see what. <laughs> I'm as excited, do you know what I mean? So I'm gonna get straight into this video. Make sure you guys like, comment if you need to channel, make sure you guys subscribe. If you guys are new here, make sure you guys hey, join Jip Nation, but don't play about it, do you get what I mean? Subscribe to the thing and let's get straight into this reaction video. I think this one's due to be juicy, blood. Due to be juicy. Alright, cool, let's get straight into the thing. Yeah, I hope you lot straight my fit as well. Like, wait, like, tell me what I was thinking in the comment section below here. Listen, I don't even want to look at the comments because I just feel like I might shit myself in it. I'm feeling like I might shit myself, you know what I mean? I don't want to look at the comments in it because these are live comments that they got going on in the thing, you know, and it's a moderator behind it. I want to know who's moderating the thing, blood, do you know what I mean? Who gave them the mod badge? That's what I want to know, blood. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I was ready, blood. Hey, what do you know about strawberry giants? What do you know about strawberry That intro was hard. I'm not gonna play it back again. You're not gonna run that back up yourself. But that intro was hard. You see my team? Hey, go oh, hard, go oh, hard. Um, on popular opinion, people who complain about cancel culture are really the, are really just offended by the thought of being held accountable for their outrageous statements and actions. Is cancel culture necessary? Yes. We need to cancel R. Kelly. Cancel culture to me is somebody who's colourless. Well, he is cancelled. Yeah, he doesn't need to be cancelled. Anything that is offensive, yeah. cancelled. Uh, right. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. R. Kelly is cancelled already. In general, wait, can I say something? In general, I'm very sure everyone has noticed with the Wiley situation, the only people that can yeah. cancel you out is people that have actual power. Exactly, like the it's Jewish people, they have a lot of power, do you know what I mean? Something. Just because you do not like someone does not mean that yeah. they're going to stop. 100%. No one, unless they, you have power, with Instagram, with social media, you can't do shit. All you can say, all you can do is dislike the person and drag them on Twitter yeah. and Instagram. There's not, I really, cancel culture is, is a myth. It's a myth. You cannot cancel nobody. 100%. Perfect example, I keep mentioning the Wiley, he's just the perfect example. He mentioned the Jews and look what happened to him. <laughs> now we. I want Let me tell you something. You see, Monty, me and Monty get along, do you know what I mean? She has this nice alpha. Monty, I'm by the girl. I like her. But yeah, pretty cute, pretty solid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's, she's like, like, she's. What is she like? Why am, I, why am I talking this? Monty's a nice girl. People now use it as a way to just tarnish people's names that they don't like. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah. trying to I say? Think that's but, true. No, no, people, yeah. a lot of people. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, yeah that's people that's use true. it. Like, there's a lot. Let me tell you something, even with like the Quavo and Sweetie situation, yeah, not gonna lie, why the hell do you wanna come on and bully my man because them two have ended up outside of a relationship? Like, I feel like council culture just, like, people use it as a way, as a quick way to get clout. If you notice that all these people on social media, first thing they do is, fuck you, ah, let me bait them out on TikTok, bruv. Go sit down with them. There are people that make chunk. false statements out there yeah. and eventually end up getting caught, yeah. and it's like, yeah. you went through all of that to tarnish someone's name. Because people yeah. know that social media is so strong, if you're the first person to put out the narrative, mm -hmm. most likely you're the People that that's people are going to believe. believe. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, trying to say? 100%. Like people, a lot of people do deserve to get cancelled and get like held accountable for their for what they do. But most times, people are just bullying other people and trying to just do yeah, useless cool. stuff. Shit on the internet is forever. You can't yeah. just go out there and start making wild statements and start saying things that you have no proof to. I agree because it can ruin people's like, lives. This actually ruins people's lives. You get what I'm trying to say? But well, some people's lives deserve to. I don't see the episode. Yeah, if it's homophobic, they're not children. Not and they're not ruined. They're still walking around being pricks, pedophiles, bastards, abusing women. I believe in forgiveness, but there's some people on this earth that we can't save, guys, okay? They don't deserve second chances. They don't deserve third chances. They're just evil. They're top. I can't lie. I agree with Lani. Like, I believe. I don't believe in second chances. Once you show me your true colours, that is it. And that's maybe because I've gone through a lot of shit in life. That's why I'm like this, it. But from you show one little weird movement from me or like a sneaky movement or you just betray my trust, you're mm -hmm. gone, it. I feel like that's the same tolerance that we need to have when it comes to these people. Toxic. And they're not going to change. So some people, they deserve to be broke, 
They don't deserve to have any followers. They should lose their Instagram, their YouTube, their book deals, their movie deals, and just like literally live on the street. But you said you'll still listen to R. Kelly, right? Yes. What would I say? You said you'll still listen to R. Kelly. You said you'll still listen to R. Kelly. You said you'll still listen to R. Kelly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't you say you that. Still listen to Stop R. Kelly. trying to say that. So what did you now, say? Dirty, you you okay, listen to R. Kelly. He said you'll still listen to Joe. You're an artist. You'll still listen to R. Kelly, your man down. I wasn't even involved in this conversation. Yeah, I came into butt end. You lot were saying if R. Kelly's song came up on the radio, would you change it? Yes, I, I would. Wait, and I was saying some people know how to separate the art from the artist. Yeah. Do you get what I'm trying to say? I didn't say, hold on. I didn't say I would listen to R. Kelly. So please, 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 wait, wait, wait. In terms of defense, he said that he would still listen to R. Kelly, but he wouldn't go out of his way to, as in if it comes up on the radio, man wouldn't go. Man wouldn't be quick to change up the team, do you know what I mean? Backpedaling! Swear down, don't say that I said I would listen to R. Kelly, bro. You are, but, but would you, yes or no? Would you do that? Would you listen don't to R. Kelly, yes or no? I don't know, because I don't listen to him normally. Do you get, I don't listen to R. Kelly. But if he came on the radio, would you switch I it? I probably wouldn't even fucking care, bro. I swear down. Paint me out like a guy that listens to what yeah, I'm very fucking pissed off right now because God has tried to paint me out like a guy that listens to R. Kelly. I don't listen to R. Kelly. Bro, don't come here and try to put me in that circle saying I listen to R. Kelly. I don't even know none of these tracks. Like, bro, don't do that, man. Bro. That's a lie. That's a lie. That's a lie. Bro, there's no way you're black and you don't know none of R. Kelly songs, bro. We all know I Ignition, I'm a flirt. Step in the name of love, happy people. Hey, all my Jamaicans out there, every single Jamaican function that you go to, step in the name of love or happy people have to play, bro. Remix, Ignition, I'm, let's not be dumb now, but you don't know, his, know, don't know his songs. Bro, you know his songs, innit? Just say they don't fuck with you, innit? That's a lie, bro. Do you know why you're being a hypocrite? Cause I... All of us know his songs. All of us know his songs. That's like, every, as much as we don't rate him at the moment, in pissing, in pissing girls' mouths and stuff like that, we don't rate him, we don't like him, he's cancelled it, but we know his songs. And let's be real, his songs are lit. However, him as a person, need for dash wear. Oh, you, you said you did! When my aunt comes on, I walk out of the club. You, you, you don't. Yes, I do! I'm, I'm very sure you. that. So, you're telling me when someone came on. Wait, what's your business? When songs come on, you have I do! I I'm very sure that. So, you're telling me when when someone came on, when songs come on, you have I do! I walk out of the club! I walk out of the club! Um, he's a rapper, his name rhymes with PM Lame. <laughs> when his song comes on in the club, I walk out and I have a breather. I go to the smokers area, I don't want to hear that. I don't want his demonic voice coming into my bloodstream. Hey, got it, don't do that, man. No, no, you said but I you listen said, to- uh, No, you, but you listen to- But I said drill, you said you listen to drill. Yes, I listen to drill. Okay, so you're like enabling. You're, ena you're an enabler. I'm enabling because you're, you're an enabler. You're enabling too because you were at the motive and you were dancing to the My Man song. No, I wouldn't, that's song. not my music. Well, bro, you said you've been in the club before dancing to drill music. How is it different? I'm with my friends. You're doing bad things. So you're picking what is good and what's right. So was we not having a conversation the other day where you was like, if, if R. Kelly was on the radio and he was playing, you wouldn't skip it. Are you all right? Nah, like we can't skip over that conversation. Just because we're here in front of everyone, you wanna, you wanna act up and you wanna, you wanna, you wanna soften yeah, it. Yeah. Let, let me explain why Drill is different. Number one, Drill is entertainment. We like to No, but apparently you said Drill is, is, is real. It's entertainment, it's different. But R. Kelly is a paedophile. But you can't pick, you can't pick and say which one is right and which one isn't right. I agree, you, we, we do, we're all hypocrites because I don't know. It's not hypocritical. Drew is entertainment wait, wait, TV. Wait, 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 you won't know. No, no, I'm not saying you, I'm not saying you. You can't cancel people because her and her friend had a beef, yeah? And they went on social media and started cutting each other and you're, you probably support the friend more. No, you can't cancel them. No, people like R. Kelly need to be cancelled and done with. That is cancelled, we don't need to debate about that. Listen, listen, let me just say something. I feel like... Let me say this whole cancel culture thing, stay out of rich people's business. What? You are hungry. I feel like people just need to just take take, take a stand back whoa, whoa, and just stay out of their whoa, business. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What's what cancel culture got to do with rich people? When you make it Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's not be stupid now. Council culture is for the rich people, the celebrities, right? People with status. It applies because at the end, can you cancel some down from the block? No, you can only cancel the people that's in the limelight. I.e. Wiley, Wiley has money, R. Kelly. 
And let's be real, even then, the council, the council coach had even worked for R. Kelly. Why? Because his sales went up record, yeah? After all of them bait him up. So he still made more money than he was making before. The guy had no money. He was skint before. And you just put more money in his pocket. So I say stay out of rich people's business because at the end of the day, you just want to come... And when I even... When I, when I said that, sorry. Let me play it on. The you would sell your soul for money. Bro, that's what you... Everything you say regards to money. What to do with rich people? When you make his money, you would sell your soul for money. You made your say, bro. That's what you. I don't mind Namdi, man. Don't mind Namdi. He's a usually calm red, isn't it? I think he's just angry that he's short. Everything. I'll sell my soul. I want to sell my soul. Let me tell you something. There's only two accounts that I've actually spoken about money, and they were actually back to back in it. First, the second, I'm not going to bait it out, but the, the episode before that, we was talking about obviously uni. Uni is what money, debt, etc., etc. We have to talk about money because a lot of uni students out there are broke in it. That's what we have to talk about money. No cancel culture leads to money. Rich people, because why? These people have status. Let's not be stupid now. We are like cancel culture only works for the celebrities. How are you going to count? How are you going to cancel someone that, that doesn't have a social media platform, that don't have a platform for themselves? When it, in essence, money lines up with everything because at the end of the day, cancel culture is popularity, it's clout, it's what gets your name trending on Twitter. You're putting more money and more traffic through their page. So at the end of the day, it's got to do with richness and some momentary value. Like, it, like I know what I'm talking about. As I said already, the cancel culture only for the people with popularity that are celebrities, that are influenced, that have influence, influencers. What? They all make what? Money. And they all make money from what? Views. Traffic. Which is what we're providing to them when we are baiting them out. You say it regards to money. University. Money. This person. Money. <laughs> money. <laughs> money. <laughs> you sell your soul for money. Listen to me. Nothing you lots have nothing to do. You're there worrying about rich people problems. Listen to me. Your, your fridge is leaking. Cut the you, have them, man. Your fridge. you have lamb scale in your toilet from 2006. I'm not saying not to hold them accountable, but bro, Thank you. go and pay your rent and just relax. Jay, Listen to me, nothing you lots have nothing to do, you're there worrying about rich people problems. Listen to me, your, your fridge is leaking, you have no food in your fridge, you have lamb scale in your toilet from 2006. I'm not saying not to hold them accountable, but bro, go and pay your rent and just relax. Jay, that's a but Jay, you're a Jay, consumer, that's you're that's a consumer too. Exactly. You love money. <laughs> Stay out of rich man business. What, what are you saying? <laughs> well, even when he's a pedophile. So you could be a pedophile. No, because but, he's, no but that, 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 that you Because he's rich, he's okay. I'm talking oh about. He just Jay Edwards guy, yeah? He's always talking about money. He's even smiling, he's even smiling. Watch him. makes the world go round, we get that. But come on, there's certain things you do for money and there's certain things you don't. This guy, he's definitely the guy that will sell his soul for money. I'm talking about the... No, don't do that, 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 like, with me, I'm very spiritual, don't do that, you know? Like, let me tell you something, with me, money makes, you have to understand that, and you know, I don't have a response for that. Yeah, but, Sorry, can but we But people on stage, there's celebrities Duh. This guy, he's definitely the guy that will sell his soul for money. I'm talking about the fact people of status, they're celebrities and stuff like that. What business do we have in whatever beef? We are consumers. Yeah. So my, it's my sibling. No, but when I say that, listen to me, blood. Sorry, listen to me. Say out rich man business. I'm talk. I'm not talking about the R. Kellys again. I have to reiterate this for you lots, for you lots to understand. I'm not talking about the R. Kellys. I'm not talking about the Dutchies, for instance. I'm talking about the Quavo and Sweetie problems, the Cardi B and offsets. What the hell are you doing in their business? Half of the time, you Lots of trying to cancel them or what? Um, I don't know. Two or two beef, but me outside success event, bruv. Yeah, okay, cool. You're gonna cancel my girl for what? Cause she went to go fight somebody. Like, let, let's be real. Unless she's done something extremely detrimental, as i.e., like obviously rape, etc., etc. Things that actually warrant a cancel. Stop giving these people free clout, and that's what I'm talking about. Stay out of rich people's business, cause we have no, we have no, we have. What place do we have in there? Not time. What? Sorry, the people that is trying to cancel people have no food in their fridge. Yeah, they're in rent arrears. They have nothing to do. They have no job. They're stuck. They're on furlough. A lot of them are whatless. First thing they do when they get up in the morning, what do they do? They go on their phone. They look on the latest Instagram shade borough posts, UK gossip TV. I'm, I'm saying that there's more productive things that we could do with our lives rather than stay in rich people's business because we're putting more money in their pockets when we don't have money in our own. And I'm saying as this, I don't have money. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm still in poverty, just like you lots. And I'm, as I'm saying it in this video, I'm also, everything I say, I take in myself. So, like, you gotta understand that I've been through certain things in life. That's why my, my, my mindset is a certain, certain way. I don't subscribe to anybody on Snapchat. I don't, I'm not really follow I'm not really following much celebrities on Instagram. Reason being, it is not my business, especially when my business is not sorted out. Make it make sense. Since I'm watching this rich person, Sorry. I'm not meant to say to my sibling, you need to stop watching that. Yeah, but I, feel like I need to say that. I'm talking about the false narratives that are put out there, just people just trying to false narratives. No, it's, it's no, like it's the, real. The popular people that are threatened with cancel culture, they've done some effed up stuff. Yes. And they yeah. need it needs to be addressed. Yeah. 
Bye-bye, he though. Bye-bye, he might be us. No, but you're not God. Their platform is built from us. Their platforms are built from us. So we have a right to be like, bro, what are you what are you doing online? But you know I'm not listening to the question. It's a myth. You still, even though you don't like that person. You cannot cancel them. How many Can people? Go I'm not talking about R. Kelly and Doctorville. Forget the pedophile part. How many people have people not liked? Gone on shade bar or shade room. Cancel, cancel, cancel. And these people it's are true. still popping. This cancel, but once you do cancel culture, it's, it's a thing where it still raises the awareness of what they've done. Okay. You understand? Every um, protest we go to, we don't get the result we, we entirely want. It's one step it's still, forward. It's one step. It's one step. Yeah. But it's still a myth. So it, yeah, it's, it's we, we, every single person here cannot cancel. So what if we deserve to be no, cancelled? but we. Times by 10 what do they deserve to be cancelled for? The thing is, yeah, what, what do they, they deserve, deserve to be cancelled for? If you're cancelling people, what what for? What exactly yeah. for? For being evil. For being a woman being for being a woman being homophobic. For being homophobic. Yes, exactly. Thank you. People have made drill songs. Trying to and make got it sound like drill artists are just entertainment artists. It's entertainment. You don't think people. some of this shit really goes down. No, 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 guys, I, I don't want. 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 I no, but he killed someone and he spoke about it. In the song. The American rappers, cool. the American rappers, the majority of them have done 50 yeah. cents. And they've done some ma- they've we done, enjoy they've it. Done I want to know why Joseph just told me to fuck off about 10 minutes ago. Joseph, you explain it. Wait, explain it. Wait, sorry, I just want, this is a personal thing. I want to know why you told me to fuck off like 10 minutes ago. Can you just leave me alone? Like, no, that's it. Really Stop me. talking to me. Joseph, are you on your period? Because you have a lot of vim for me today and I don't understand it. The cameras come on and you keep telling me to shut up. You're being bare aggressive. What's going on, baby boy? What's going on, baby boy? Talk to me. I wanna no no no. I wanna know. I know. I wanna know why he's being. Why do you keep talking to me? Because you're fake on camera. You have all this vim, but behind behind the scenes, me and you lips. So shut. Behind the scenes, me and you lips. You should be on camera. Here we go again. Here we go again. And bad boy music even made I'm not a part of this one. Please, my phone is not so easy. My phone is not gonna ring, sharp. Okay. Show, show, show the love! Show, show the love on camera! Hey, hey, hey. What, so what, what, you, what are you talking about? Fuck yeah, 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 off! Fuck off! What do you mean? What you love? What love? What love? You, so why are you listening if you don't like me? Oh, Lani good. Lani good. Lani good. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I want to go on this again. Why, man? Why? Oh, he's oh. Look, he's smiling. He's still blushing. And Joseph, Joseph's still blushing. Joseph's still blushing. Joseph has a crush. Joseph has a crush. Joseph has a crush. Lani, are you fucking stupid? He's flabbergasted. <laughs> You see, it's just sexual tension. No, you're, you're mad. It's sexual tension. I'm convinced, tension I'm convinced you. today that you're very mad. You're, hey, you know, fuck off, man. Hey, I need to be substituted, man. Get me off this fucking debate, man. What's this? <laughs> Yo. Damn. Yo. Mess up, bro. Mess up. Yo. Wait, wait, wait. Why would you do this to me, Lani? Like, I need to get the branch to follow me right now. Because what? Why do you feel the need to bring this up right now? This is not relevant to what we're even talking about, right? Like, why? Like, just why? <laughs> Let me say what I got to say about this sex, uh, this um, topic. Personally, someone like big as R. Kelly. What's this? Damn. Big mess up. Mess up. Big mess up. Wait, wait, wait. Why would you do this to me, like? It's okay. I just want the branches following me right now. It's okay. Me. Why do you feel the need to bring this up right now? This is not relevant to what we're even talking about. Like, it's okay. Why, lot? Like, just why? Let me tell you what I got to say about this sex, uh, this why, um, Lani, why? topic. Personally, someone like big as R. Kelly, you can't. He's obviously is in jail because obviously there are proofs of him doing shit. But people as big as him, and if he didn't have a proof. You can't cancel those people. Get there's big, big business people investments into this. They're not gonna allow you to cancel that person. You really think Jeffrey Epstein is dead? I'm just gonna say allegedly, right? 
even when we look at say Dasha Veli's incident right you know, there's been more evidence that he has done it than hasn't done it and yet like he's coming back through do you understand what I'm saying he's dropping songs he's coming back slowly on social media and people are starting to accept him and I think with council culture it only lasts for a moment because then people will just you know it, like people's time spans are short and in reality it just like it just goes back to normal nobody really cares about what happened before like some people will hold on to it yes but like remember the fans are the fans and then the public's the public is either in or you're out and you've got to remember something like the fans ride harder for the people that's outside than the, when ride harder than the people that's on the outside you know what I mean so it, it makes sense going to be cancelled let me tell you something if you want to be big you have to be doing these shits no you, no, you no, you don't. No, you don't. You don't have to be no, bad anymore. Wait, wait, wait. You don't have to be bad. Wait, wait. You have to do what? No. You don't have to sell your soul you to, to be successful, no. darling. People who don't do it are underrated, just like J. Cole, for example. Do what? Do what? Like, this nasty stuff. Uh, this nasty stuff, stuff. yeah. You're trying to say you have to be up in order to do these things. No, 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 no. I'm saying, I'm saying you have to do this dirty stuff to no, be you up. No, you do not. Hey, yeah, come off and sit. Yeah, come off and sit. Come hey, on. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. People pay you for that shit. Yes, they well, do. She's not like you because Jeffrey Epstein. That's how he built his money. Oh, you have to do bad Nobody to said get every... big in this life and the world that we're living in. No, you right don't. Now. No, you for don't. For example. You either have to. I'm not doing it. I'm sorry, but I'm not doing it. There's no way I'm playing into any negativity to get big at the top. Any drama, I want to stay clear with it, man. Join the Illuminati. Ain't no one telling me to piss in nobody's mouth to reach to the top. You must be freaking crazy. There's morals. I'm not sending myself for no money. Be part of the paedophile groups. Or somehow you must to God have done some bad things. Respect to God every day. Respect to God every day. If you look at yeah. all the artists, they have done something like Illuminati, for example, or oh. allegedly, girl. What are you talking oh. about? Oh. If you let me, we know Illuminati is real, but like it's not everybody that's done it. Do you know what I mean? No, if you let me, if you let me. Speak. Just said all, so he said everybody. It's not all of them. That's though. every single one of them. I don't give it's a fuck. Not every single one. I don't give a fuck. Can't say it all, so he said all. Oh. If you let me, oh. no. If you let me, if you. Just said all, so he said everybody is not all of them. That's though. every single one of them. I don't give a fuck. No, no. I don't give a you fuck. Can't you can't say, you can't say you that. that. You know every rapper. Guys, okay, look, she is being extreme. But wait, a lot of people who want, even us, a lot of people who want clout. A lot of us who want clout fame. A lot like of people narcissistic and have narcissistic traits. What do you mean, like? We're you? into ourselves a, shade. a little bit. He said and, like I you. never said you. I said, said like a lot of I celebrities. Yeah, I'm saying like you. Like me. Oh my god. It's just because you want to fuck. Stop it! Wait, Lonnie, you, you, you fucking kiss me. Oh, Lonnie, you kiss me. Lonnie, you kiss me. 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 Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Guys, I'm not going to lie. Um, sorry, Lonnie, you know I love you. Look, I knew of this story before I ever met Jason. It was made apparent to me that he was the one that kissed her. But. Now it's all out in the open. We know that she can say. It's just because you want to fuck. Stop it! Wait, Lonnie, you, you, you fucking kissed me. Oh my god. Lonnie, you kissed him. You kissed him. Say it again. You kissed him. Oh. But he kissed me back. So what's ah. the problem? No. Ah. Ah. No. Let's not act. I'm tired. Here we go. Here we go. You're not the one that was moving me. Since the start of back chat, auditions, everything. You were on me, and now you're coming onto camp. You left all this out, my yeah, friend, but it's fine. Make it seem like, oh, I'm chasing you around or whatever. So this is Joseph, yeah? I'm going to reenact the scene. So me and Joseph are sitting in the car, and Joseph and me, our eyes connect. And he's always telling me how beautiful I am. Joseph is a sexy chocolate god. So then our eyes connect. Oh, and my God. Our heads get closer oh and closer, God. and then... Mwah! Must have happened. Oh, it wasn't a pet doll. Bad. There might have been a little tongue, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <gasps> no! No! My way. life is over! No. No. This did not happen I, recently. I just in behind scenes. No, no, I'm behind you every oh, step of the way, bro. Hey. You are a liar! Oh, hey. You lie! Like, Joseph is a little boy and Elani is like a big woman. It's just like, I don't know, little boy. I don't know, it's just weird. It's weird, it's weird. Like, I'm weird. Like, I can't even see some face together. Kissing with tongues. Joseph, man, like, 
You should have known this would happen. I mean, it's Lani, for goodness sake. But don't worry, man, I got you either way. There is a lot of celebrities, because celebrities can be quite into themselves, actually, and have who do, who are, you know, they're fucked up and they do do bad things. I don't think all of them, that was what I was going to say, but she has some points. But you know when she mentioned Illuminati and um, Freemasons, what you don't really don't understand is that once, once you acquire, acquire a certain level of wealth, yeah, you'll be introduced to certain clubs and certain, um, what do you call it, in life. That is fact on the number one. That does not necessarily mean it is a bad thing. But you don't have to sell your soul. Well, you don't have to. You don't have to sell your soul. You don't even have to you don't have to sell your soul. That's what I mean. You don't have to sell your soul to the devil to be successful. Why is Because the, because people have said it's a bad thing. No, I know Illuminati is a bad thing because I did my research about it. Okay, do you lots feel like rapists are born um rapists? They can be. Do you? Feel, okay, cool. I personally feel like the clout, the like. Yeah, the environmental no, no, no. can can contribute can contribute to to them turning yeah. the way they do but some because have brains. yeah yeah, some people yeah but like you that, need like to understand that. that when people look up to someone yeah it is a hard responsibility you can't be yourself do you get what I mean so it's like you're trapped in this bubble that they might just mm. you know want to burst out of and do crazy stuff because they've been robbed of their livelihood so their secrets mm. 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 huh? A lot of like trauma can, you know what I mean? This is why some people have turned into sex addicts because of certain um, molestation that happened when they were younger and stuff like that. You've got to realise that upbringing does have a lot of parts and experiences have a lot of parts to play when it comes I'm to... I'm saying it can. You don't oh, to understand. Yeah, can, like can, it can, can contribute. But certain people were evil beforehand, you know what I'm saying? Before they bust, they were robbing girls. The only way you can ask a question. Can I ask a question? If you made a YouTube video and you've added a YouTube video and you've accumulated over a hundred thousand or even a million views, do you not deserve to get cancelled? You deserve to get cancelled. I don't. I don't care. If what? If you lie on people, deserve feet. to know the truth, yeah, right? People deserve. So okay, so so you deserve to be cancelled then. What have I lied about? Because you lied. You said you've lied about stuff on YouTube. <laughs> don't don't make. You said you lied. Hold on. You hold on a second. Lie. So you deserve. I've, to be I've turned it around. I've done it myself. Okay, but I've been, so but you said if someone lies on YouTube and they've lied in a the video, they deserve to be cancelled. But if you've not addressed it, you're still lying. You deserve to be cancelled. The only Either way, you're still told a lie. Just with the fact that you admitted your wrongdoings. Just like that's like saying if you could, um, if you admit it's if you admitted to doing murder, you are not a murderer, please. The only main difference is that you've stopped and they haven't yet. They could stop eventually, so why is it just because no, they haven't they stopped have yet? Stopped exactly. You see, so, when they have stopped and they've, they've accepted that. Exactly. Well. If you don't like someone, don't stream. Don't watch their music videos, don't stream. Starve them of their money because if somebody's cancelled, their, their pockets will run dry. That's the only way. I feel like this whole cancel culture is very temperamental. Like, yeah, as much as you want to cancel somebody, you're actually driving them like more, more sales and their money and stuff like that, more traffic and stuff like that. I feel like as much as people like to uh, think, oh, I'm actually cancelling him, you're giving him more traffic yeah, on his page, you're making his impressions go up. The more you talk about someone, the more irrelevant exactly. they are. Exactly. Okay, and this whole cancel culture thing, in a couple of weeks time, social media is a wave, like, in a couple of weeks time, it actually just, it, it just fizzles out. Like, oh, we fuck with you again, they do something good and everyone just forgets about it. We're trying something new this season, guys. We're going to stop off four people on cast, two girls, two boys. I really hope I don't get voted off because I've got a lot to say. I know I haven't been as vocal in this episode, but trust me, keep me on and you'll see what I got for you guys. Okay. Oh, oh. Yes, I, don't I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. That's the problem. Jadis, 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 Jadis. I don't know. You lost me. No, is it, it's one person, no? No, it's two. I know he hasn't had anything though. I feel bad because he hasn't had anything. I want to use a loud dude. Hey, you hear that? No. One day the lord if she gets on my nerves. <laughs> what did she say? What did she say while we were like, whoa? Oh, <laughs> she said just to be successful. No, not Jason. I think Emily, because last time we bought Emily, 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 we're picking Ezo because we feel like you've said a lot and you said enough. I didn't even say anything! No, you said enough and then I'm picking one to be, you know, we feel like you've done it. You've you done your diligence. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I'm a big... No, I didn't even say anything! No, you said enough and then I'm picking one to be, you know, we feel like you've done it. You've done your diligence. Yeah. Okay, I'm bringing in Charlotte and Flaky. 
And we want to bring on Eng um, Emily and Jesse. Is cancel culture necessary? No, no, it's not. Is that because you listen to R. Kelly still? So. And you don't laugh because you do it. You do it as well. Hey, Millie, NK, you lot was there as well. You are part of the problem. You're after the better. You're doing this right now. That's what you tried to do. That no, you're doing this right now. That's what you said. That's what you said. Basically, what Charlotte is saying, I agree with her. Yeah, you have to protect your energy if something triggers you. But I just feel like if you're the kind of person like NK that can separate the art from the artist. I feel like I'm that kind of, hold on, hold on, hold on. I also feel like I'm that kind of person. What R. Kelly did, R. Kelly is a monster. He's nasty. He's hold on, disgusting. R. Kelly is a monster, yeah? R. Kelly is a nasty man, he's a predator, and he is in jail where he's supposed to be. Amen. Amen. Like, that's not good enough, he needs work. He needs work. He needs work. You guys are not letting him finish, you know? Can you finish your point, please? He is in jail where he is supposed to be. I feel like you guys are putting too much. Music is not. I am, I am, I am, I am. But I do not. Oh. We didn't need to do that. We didn't need to call it stupid now. Oh. Oh. Hey, 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 don't do that. Don't do that again. 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 Sorry. What do you think you're doing? No! Those three times are dead as well, man. Say sorry, Yami. Say sorry. At the end of the day, you could have been cancelled for doing smash or pass on minors, but... You know what I'm saying? But... But... No, but I'm going to say that, like... Why are you not cancelled? Sorry, why didn't you? Why, is, why, why are you doing a smash and pass on the minor? Oh That's God, actually illegal. Who is the minor? I didn't say I was going to fuck him. But he's in your vid, he's a minor. Yeah, but I didn't say I was going to fuck him. You're doing a smash and pass on a minor. It's on your channel. It's on your channel. It's on your channel, it's on your channel. It's on your channel though. Why are you doing a smash and pass on a minor? Like, that's actually illegal. Who is the minor? I didn't say I was going to fuck him. But he's in your vid, he's a minor. Yeah, but I didn't say I was going to fuck him. You're doing a smash and pass on a minor. It's on your channel. It's on your channel. It's on your channel though. But by your logic, I don't agree with that logic. Because I called your story time stupid. You're going for a low blow. It's not a low blow. It happened. It happened. Hold yes. on, hold on. Are you not sexualizing your content and you're, you got kids watching you when you're doing dating diaries? So we can go. Wait, wait, wait. wait. What if when I go when I go on fucking YouTube and it says who the fuck is your audience? Not for kids. Not for fucking kids. No, fuck you. Try it with that nigga's mind. Don't try it. There were people in my game who were 17, so they were allowed uh, to speak about it. I never said nothing. I didn't answer the issue. You're not I can't lie though. Um I'm the person that obviously orchestrated the people and put the people together. As I said before in many videos, I didn't know that the two females would have behaved the way how they behaved in that video in it because I was giving them a chance, right? With that being said, none of the girls were under the age of 18. All the men then were 20, 18, 20, well, it's not 18, sorry, 19, 20. 20 and above, yeah? There was actually no girls in the video that were 17. However, it still makes it okay for them to smash or pass a guy that's one year younger than, more, more younger than them or even a couple of months because it's not illegal, do you understand what I'm saying? But I understand that they're coming from where you put a minor in a video, etc, etc. But she actually made the video up on the spot. Like, literally, she was like, oh, can I film a video? No. I was like to her, do you want to film a video? She was like, yeah, da, 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 whatever. She picked the names out, literally just out of her hat. She just said, who's the latest people? And that's how she did the video, innit? But um, I can't lie, I can't back you on this one. Nobody in the video is under the age of 18. So. You no, but I used to. I did. I used to. I used to um, listen to. I can't. I, no, wonderful. You see, wonderful with Ash, Ashanti and Ja Rule. That's my. That's one of my favorite songs. I don't listen to it anymore. Also, also, there's also a rumor that Marcus Houston had sex with um, that other guy. I don't. And my one of my favorite songs of Marcus Houston is in the club, and I don't listen to it anymore. Cool. No, so no, I, no, I, no, I no, 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 no. That's calm. That, that's fine. That's how you. Businesses. Oh, businesses. That's, businesses. Like, that's how you want to respond to. R. Kelly, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm telling it you that have to be if, R. Kelly, if R. Kelly jumps on, if I hear R. Kelly's song, then, I'm yeah, not going yeah, to skip yeah, it. Yeah, However, I still condone his actions, but yeah, I'm not going to skip the song. You're supporting him. I'm, I'm not supporting him. Wait, 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 he's basically saying he's not going to contribute to R. Kelly. Like, I think he 
each to their own. I don't think when you've got to remember that like, music is just a vibe. You know, it only lasts for like two to three minutes. I don't think when anyone is listening to the songs, they actually deep. Oh, right, this person did that. The next. Now, I do re- like there's some people out there that do actually have it stuck in their head. Once this person's done, I'm going to remember it for life. But like, if we're just being realistic in everyday day to day activity, when you hear a song come on, even like when you're walking in Selfridges, for example, or you're walking in, I don't know, Tesco and they're playing music, you're not thinking, oh, right, I'm going to come out of the shop because they're playing the person. Do you know what I mean? The same thing when you're in the car, Capital Extra comes on, and then maybe, for example, maybe Lani when Tian Wei comes on. Yeah, she might skip the song because she knows it's like direct to her, but like, say if it's just passive, like, cool. I don't know R. Kelly from anywhere. Like, even though he has done some t- terrible, messed up things, if I see him, I would not go up to him and ask for an autograph or anything like that. But if your song comes on the radio and it's one of the songs that I fuck with, I wouldn't skip it but it's not me condoning his behaviour if that makes sense and I get I get it it's kind of contradictive but like you gotta remember like even though he did what he did he made some good music and I think like no one listens to shit music do you know what I mean so I just feel like um, I don't condone anything he's done I think it's I think it's messed up I've watched the documentaries I think it's really bad but if we're being realistic now on everyday day to day activity now it's a different there's a different thing going out of your way to support somebody like going out of your way to stream their music go on it Instagram and like comment all these different kind of things that's a different move but I feel like when you're in a car and it just passively comes on like your mate, your brain ain't thinking oh Ryan let me switch the radio like all this is logical thinking we don't have logical thinking on a day to day basis let's be real on like as the minutes go by it's not every minute logical it's too much brain power our brain's quite not going to kill himself why does the radio still play R. Kelly then? tell me no, tell me, uh, uh, tell me, why, why, tell me why, why does the radio, why does the radio play R. Kelly? Because it's entertainment! Wait, they don't, that was they don't, like that was they, they don't, yes they do! Yes they do! To be fair, there are lists, yeah, of artists who are banned from radio to get played. R. Kelly is on that list, I guarantee you. They don't have the same energy for white people as well, because Elvis Presley is still a legend, and he, has done similar things as to Michael Arcade. Jackson as well. well Michael Jackson. Jackson. I disagree. These people are cancelled, bro. Elvis Presley's not cancelled. Where do you, where do you, where do you see people spending their day gloating over Elvis Presley? That side up. Where do you see people gloating over Michael Jackson? It's not because they've cancelled them. It's just because time Where do you see it? People what? Elvis Presley is seen as a legend till today among his community. His music is seen as, his music is seen as legendary. Do you know why? Cancel culture doesn't work effectively if the person's dead. Which is why Elvis Presley, Michael Jackson, so many other yeah. people, the Prince, the, the, the popularity of yeah, still dies. They, they said that, oh, I, I still listen to Vice Cartel. Just get, and Michael still was saying D. That, that is what you said. You asked, you asked me if I still listen yeah, to Vice yeah, Cartel. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, yeah, and my... Pro- what does he do? What was He's a murderer. No so you condone no murderers. No you are, you're basically a murderer. There's no proof. There is no proof. Wait, hold on. If you look at Jamaican culture... How did he get convicted then? How did he get convicted? My brother, stay in African people. <laughs> no. So, oh, so they made fake evidence for my man. Say that about other people that are in prison or the government are after yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. That's That's it. It. Why is it when it's Vance Patel, your, your guys are... You know this class is very hard because like, not hard as in hard, as in hard, as in difficult, because... 99.9% of them are African and then when it's with me, me and God is the only Jamaicans, do you know what I mean? Vibes can't tell, there is no hardcore evidence that the guy did what he did. Like, he's very connected to the murder, like there was voice notes and stuff like that, but there's no actual evidence that he committed the crime. He's just in there because they're trying to hold him down. He's one of the biggest artists in Jamaica. Now, if it was like, if it was one of those things where he actually did it, then I feel like there would be uproar in Jamaica because Jamaica doesn't actually condone, um, like, 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 say for example, there's, there's this big thing going on in Jamaica at the moment where they're raping young girls they don't condone that shit that like, they take that shit very seriously and I can't like it's praise in Jamaican culture like killing shit like, it, it, it gives you more status because it makes you more feared but there's no actual evidence that Vibes Cartel actually did anything so right now he's serving an unwarranted like prison sentence just because like that like the evidence only kind of leads to him and his crew if that yeah, it's difficult yeah, you would have to search it out. Out. Not, not, not Caribbean shaming, guys. Hey, not African yeah. shaming, guys. What the fuck is this, man? You don't have something against Jamaicans. That's yeah. what I'm feeling, man. You don't want to get yeah. rid of Vibes Cartel. Yeah, yeah, that's the truth, man. Top of the man. Yeah, has a I feel better. Come out talking about R. Kelly's nastiness. It ain't the same for Vibes Cartel. There's a hate train for Vibes Cartel. Yeah, look it up. But you can't say that a badge is not making a change. It doesn't matter how though doing the twitter cancelling of these 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 acs yeah Yeah, i was i was retweeting you weren't there dude what 
You're what? too old. To, you've missed that time and you're too old. Oh my god. <laughs> no, but 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 you were there. Did you think that way of can or canceling was that. justified? I would have done. Like, you think the way they went about it through Twitter was justified? But that's yeah. where they was performing. No, it's no, where no, you no, perform no. that act, the way you get addressed. But so but but you could have gone to bed. What? Like, like, no, like, you got to try to say, like, why are you going to Twitter? That's true because that's because, because social, social media is powerful. It can, it can put people in defenseless positions because yeah. at the end of the day, yeah, people. if you're getting cancelled for something. Yeah, it's true. When you want to make some, why you, like, so, uh, for example, I'm um, sorry, one, one thing that doesn't, you know, might really call me for saying this, but say if you get raped, why are you running into social media to go and tell them rather than going to the police? Go to the police first, and then if you feel like it needs to be them out on social media, then do that to your story. Do you get what I mean? Because I understand that it's healing with um, speaking about it. But like, say if you you haven't reported it to the police, you haven't taken no like, like, kind of you've taken no action to gain like justice or put the person away and prevent them from doing it again. You've literally that, like done it in the name of clout. That, those are those are the kind of things I don't condone because at the end of the day, like it's your trauma. The end of, it's your it's your trauma. It's your like it's your choice to deal with it the way how like how you want to deal with it. However, say if it's something as serious as rape or abuse and stuff like that, and you haven't reported it to the police, why are you coming on social media to come and say it as if we can do anything? What can we do? The law is not in our hands. We're not metropolitan police. We don't have a jet. We don't have a fucking HMP prison ready there to put somebody in jail. What can we do? Because at the end of the day, it's just going to give you five minutes of fame and then tomorrow we don't care. Do you know what I mean? Like, um, it's, sorry, it's a harsh reality. It's different if you're using your experience to um, grow. And like, imp like, kind of relate with people. Just be like, this is what I went through. It's different. It's different. Oh, just want to say one more thing. It's, it's actually the only last thing I want to say because I feel like I've only shown one side, and I I don't feel one sided in this argument. I think there's good and bad sides mm -hmm. of. Um, That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. 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 No, for instance, I think sometimes we're harsh. We're really, really uh, harsh. Yeah. We are human. People are human, so people are allowed to make mistakes and errors. Like when everyone was canceling N Nella for her tweets and all of that, I think it was a bit. Like, Bro, everyone, everyone used to make those jokes back then. Like that's just what it was back that then. Bad. It wasn't coming. It wasn't that bad, didn't it? So I think sometimes, like we, like we're just, we're just pressed for no reason. Like, you putting that message out there saying, "Oh, you can separate." You're right, enabling. Uh, you are. Enabling. You are. Enabling. Well, you're what? enabling vibes cartel. Then, like. No, you're being paid. Uh, You've yeah, not yeah, seen yeah. the victim of this person that got killed. Family, go out and say. Because his body is inside the ground. You haven't seen the victim's family go out and say, bro, Vibes yeah, Cartel's family. You've, you've never seen it. Vibes Cartel can still kill people from pen. He's that strong. <laughs> that Wait, you're, you're, not, you're not being what? serious I'm being here. I'm being I'm not being serious. Hey, you guys, don't stop. You don't, start, you don't know nothing about your... Oh, please, please, please. Go chat to your house, puppy shop. Like, what the... F what the hell? That episode was good. I can't lie, the first episode was really good. Um, again, I, it was... Yeah, it, it was a lot to take in. Kissing a guan. All them something that type of R killing them thing there and all these things. I just think overall on the cancel culture subject that cancel culture doesn't actually work. However, no, sorry, it worked. Like it, it's good for exposing people that have actually done it, but there's pros and cons to a lot of things. We gotta remember that. So like social media doesn't see the full story. We show what we want to show, and sometimes the only if like, there's only a limited uh, amount of information out there. We can make a wrong judgment that can cost somebody their life. Let's remember social media like trolls. When you've got like hundreds of thousands of people coming for you, it can really affect you at the end of the day. Do you understand what I'm saying? Especially, like, suppose you're innocent and all these people are saying that, I hate you, I wish you're dead. If you have dead parents, oh, you should lie down in the grave. Like, it, it's, it, sometimes we don't know, sometimes we don't know the full story, but you have a kind of hard for people. And we got to understand, like, sometimes we got to put ourselves in their shoes. And I, and I feel like, you know, whereas we need to cancel, but can we ever right, rightfully cancel somebody if there's not enough evidence? Like, sometimes there's no evidence at all. Do you understand what I'm saying? And I just feel like, you know, we shouldn't be cancelling people for like uh, a harmless relationship domestic as in arguments and stuff like that like obviously abuse is the next thing rape is the next thing of course cancel them because they deserve to be cancelled but I feel like cancel culture can ruin a lot of people's careers because there's a lot of clout chasers out there but I do strongly feel like if they have done the crime you should they should be penalised for it 110% um, I really like this episode yeah I really like this episode That's, that just pretty much wraps it up for this video I hope you guys enjoyed it if you listen I've got some lit content coming for you guys so I hope you guys like Comment if you need to tell me you guys subscribe. I've got some lit videos coming. Season 5 of Backchat, you don't know this is going to be lit. Go over to Shed Central, follow up your team. See you guys in the next video, and I'm out. Thank you guys for watching.